Hi, this is Lou. I'm in Countryside Ridge, which is a subdivision near Linda Vista and Hartman uh, in the northwest section of Tucson, out in newly annexed part of Morana. Uh, it's convenient to I-10 and a number of other areas. Um, we're standing at the corner of Winter Wind, Winter Wren, and Canyon Low Tree or to Tohi. Um, I'm looking sort of north and west towards the mountains, and uh, I will pan the street so you can see that's the entrance that we came in on or I came in on. I'm going to walk up here and turn towards the house so that you can see the house. It's a two-car garage and with this house there's parking on the apron. Uh, as always, I will warn that if parking overnight on the apron is important for you, you need to check with your manager before signing a lease to, to make sure on the CCNRs because I don't always know that answer standing here. However, you saw that there are several properties where there are people parking and appears overnight, so you might be safe, but again, check with the manager. We're at the front door. This property is uh, three bedrooms, two baths, uh, gr lovely uh, great room, living room, dining room, and then a kitchen family great room as well. We'll go enter. And I will turn on the light so that it illuminates a little bit. I have my sunglasses on, so everything's a little darker for me than if you came in and didn't have your sunglasses on. Uh, you can see the inlay tile. I'll walk over here so you can see more of the length of the living room and the kitchen dining, uh, kitchen breakfast area and family room. We'll walk back through. The kitchen is sort of to the right. We're looking at the breakfast area, the family room. The door to the backyard is open, ajar, so I will walk out through there, push it open a little farther so I can get myself through. This is really beautiful. Really, really beautiful here. I'm wondering if that's squash. I'm not sure. I don't know the plants as well as I should. Uh, those look like they may have been peach trees or maybe peach trees. There's a pepper plant there. Uh, that looks like a variation. That looks like uh, uh, hibiscus or maybe a variation of a bird of paradise. I'm not sure. Back in. We're looking into the kitchen area. It's a compact, efficient kitchen, not a lot of steps. Pantry is right there. Two door refrigerator with ice and water. A gas stove with sealed burners and the microwave above. It's a dual sink, and you can see that there's one for cleaning vegetables and draining and scraping and with a dish with a disposal and then there's the big deeper sink. We'll go out this door into the hall and I sort of sidestep a little bit so I don't have to turn. And we have the uh, hall bath, the guest bath here, single pedestal sink, a counter sink, it's not a pedestal but on a counter. Uh, full tub and uh, shower. I'll turn to the right. We have a linen closet right there. We're into the laundry room with cupboards above. I will let you see that it has both gas and electric hookup depending on whether you have a gas or 
of our electric dryer. We walk out here into the garage. It's a good sized garage. As you can see, the furnace, air handler, and the um, hot water tank are here in the garage for ease of access, maintenance, etc. That is a nice feature. Not all homes have it. It doesn't work everywhere, but it does work in this style of a home. We're in the hall. We'll look into the guest bedroom. Well, the second guest bedroom, but bedroom number three into the corner so you can get a panorama of the room. Ceiling fan with lights. Welcome to what I call bedroom number two. Again, a nice wall closet, sort of a plant shelf above. Again, a ceiling fan with lights. We're back now into the master. This is uh, a very high ceiling, peak ceiling. And now we're into the master bath. The commode is slightly separate. A big tub, garden style tub with shower. Dual vanities, medicine cabinet, a good closet, lots of uh, hanging space, double hanging on both sides, single dress height, uh, and, and that could be changed if you didn't want to. You could obtain a longer rod, but I would think having those, those baskets and shelves there is a real plus. And I'll walk into this corner, back in so you can see it. And we'll, and there's a little backlight there. You need the windows open, which is a plus for the light, but it's a negative when you're taking a video. So we'll walk up to the great room. I will give you one quick view of the kitchen, family room, dining, breakfast area. And now in the dining room area, the great room, with the living room portion, with that wonderful tile inlay in the floor. And I'll walk out the front of the property on Winter Wren in uh, Countryside Ridge near Linda Vista and Hartman. Very peaceful here, by the way. Thank you. Have a great Tucson day.